And happy Wednesday morning. Let's talk about that wind, of course, created some damage and brought us some power outages last night and early this morning. It's much better to start the day, but still kicking around at over 20 miles per hour in the Champlain Valley, parts of the Northeast Kingdom. And then now in Saranac Lake, they have gusts that are at 33 miles per hour. So still impressive, but again, so much better. And this will get a little bit better as the day goes on behind the cold front that moved through last night. Of course, brought the rain as well. Lots of it. Some good downpours that's moved on out. Just a few spot showers left over and already some lake effect snow in St. Lawrence County where they do have a winter weather advisory in place over the next couple of days here for the potential for snow to slowly add up to several inches. Uh, in the meantime, the rest of us are actually going to dry up pretty well here and we're also going to cool off a little bit. So yesterday we felt temperatures in the 50s this morning, still 42 in Burlington and we still have some mid and upper 40s along the Connecticut River Valley, but then you yeah, look e West and they've got temperatures down into the low 30s already. So those numbers are dropping and will continue to drop this morning before barely getting back up towards 40, maybe 41 by around 3 or 4 o'clock this afternoon in the Champlain Valley. But otherwise, it's just a cooler day and most of it will be spent in the 30s with a mix of sun and clouds. Uh, do count on though some of those lake effect snow showers having an impact on parts of especially the northern half of our area. Here's that stream coming off of Lake Ontario. It is just going to be wiggling north and south over the next couple of days here while the rest of us have a mix of sun and clouds and are pretty dry. Tomorrow morning still that little band is just wobbling right over parts of St. Lawrence, Franklin counties and will eventually stretch all the way into Vermont at times. So this is going to be pretty persistent with a west southwesterly wind over the next few days and will add up in several places. Let's have a look at where it could add up. Again, it's going to be very small band and we'll be moving a little bit. So uh, take these exa the exact placement of this with a grain of salt, but some darker blues, as you can see in Southern St. Lawrence County, Franklin County could mean over three, four, maybe up to five or six inches in some localized areas because of that band and the, at least a dusting or so in some locations in Northern Vermont. Over the next couple of days, there's that chance for that lake effect snow. Other than that, you're going to find some sun in between and a definite cool down in the 30s for the end of the work week. Similar again over the weekend, not a whole lot going on, just a few scattered light snow showers mixed in with some sun. David, back to you.